My name's Emma Scott. I'm the Voluntary Services Manager for Sheffield Teaching Hospitals. So that covers all of the five adult hospitals in Sheffield. And I look after the team who support our volunteers. In pre-COVID times, we'd have about 450 or 500 volunteers at any one time working within the hospitals in a huge variety of roles, from welcomers on the front door to the hospital radio, um, to activities volunteers doing activities with patients on the ward. Um, we have a clothing for patients project where people donate clothing um, which is given to patients who, who might need it so that nobody gets discharged without appropriate clothing. We have volunteers on the wards, we have uh, clerical volunteers, we also have a, quite a number of volunteer partnerships, um, so that includes our chaplaincy volunteers, our League of Friends uh, charity who run a tea bar and a shop, um, we have volunteers as well who deliver medications to the wards, our pharmacy runners. Uh, we have those both at the Northern General and Western Park now. Um, so it's it's a really big undertaking and all of our volunteer roles uh, all ha do have one similarity though, and that is that they exist to enhance the experience of being in hospital for patients, for visitors, uh, and also to to some extent supporting staff as well that's what our volunteers do it for that's why they give up their free time and um, to come in and, and and give their time to the patients to make their experience in hospital that little bit more pleasant whether that's being able to find their way better or you know have an entertaining afternoon uh, on the ward doing some art projects um, which distract them from what's going on distract them from their pain their worries um, and provide a bit of a, a social aspect as well During COVID, um, volunteering's changed quite a bit. So it, it was closed down to start with for everyone's safety uh, and then slowly opened up again, um, right to the point where now we've, we've got almost 200 volunteers now back on the books. Nothing in any high risk areas, nothing in any clinical areas at the moment for everyone's safety, but, um, but still doing the pharmacy running, still doing the clothing for patients and then a huge chunk of them involved in the vaccination programme as well, both at the large scale site at Sheffield Arena and also at the Northern General Staff uh, Hub. We couldn't do, couldn't do any of this without the support from Sheffield Hospitals Charity, um, who, who fund a number of roles within the department, um, as well as crucial uh, crucial funding for volunteer expenses, volunteer uniform, um, and also really importantly, reward and recognition for volunteers so that we can, you know, send a Christmas card to say thank you. We can hold a, an awards event um, and we can just do those little things um, just to say thank you to people for, uh, it almost doesn't seem enough, but for giving their time freely to Sheffield Teaching Hospitals.